Good evening, everyone. And again, to much belated Lemon's Eye Racing Racing Night. This is week three, and I am Eric Rude, Everything Bagel at 24 Hours of Lemons. Thank you for your patience, and thank you for finding your Thursday evening so boring that this qualifies as entertainment for you. Uh, we are late because Lemon's finally did it. We broke eye racing. Uh, this is our third night. Uh, we're at Summit Point Raceway in our favorite American backwater, West Virginia. Summit Point Shenandoah's once regular date on Lemon's calendar, and tonight we return virtually after a seven-year absence. Uh, be sure to enjoy the conversation on Facebook Live, YouTube, or Twitch, wherever you're watching this, and get ready for as close as we can get to real Lemon's tr racing. Uh, crack open a Lemon's caliber beverage and get ready for what vaguely resembles racing soon. Joining me again are my broadcast partners this week, Sean Yoder of Nemesis Lab and Ryan Bauer, a.k.a. the Bearded Sim Racer. Hey guys, how you doing this evening? You with us, Yoder? I believe he's trying to get his best to get in the sim. He seems to be having some difficulties. He should be joining us here shortly. Uh, yeah, I wanted to thank everybody at home for being patient and waiting with us here while we're getting uh, everything up and running and uh, look forward to be able to bring these races to you. It looks like we've got about 12 minutes left in this warm up. Um, just excited as you hear the saber dance. Classic. Classic. As oh, mentioned, this. Go ahead. Yeah, so we got a jet of slideways in the last turn there with a couple of Miatas chasing them down. Good stuff. Yeah. Sorry. We're still uh, adjusting to being able to actually see a race after struggling for a good chunk of time. Seems like servers were reset or something. Lots of people having trouble get in, getting into the race uh, tonight. But, uh, yep. Oh, Miata doing what Miatas do right there. Ouch. Classic. I just... I just want to say, to be fair, we didn't really break iRacing. We had a lot of help from uh, iRacing. You know, this is a, we, we totally missed the first race. Apologize for that. We're going to try and keep up, try and still bring you guys two races tonight. I see Troy Fru field, Troy Fru racing this week with pedals that are actually a Dance Dance Revolution pad, which is amazing. That is amazing. Uh, my, Maybe worth following for bits and pieces of this race. Uh, is that the same person that has the Pac-Man joystick rigged up for steering? Uh, that is somebody else. So that's what that, we. That's amazing. It's taken a couple weeks, but we we've gotten people into uh, this the spirit of lemons for this. There's, uh, a, there's yeah. a rig made out of a stop sign pole. There's the Dance Dance Revolution thing. There's a mouse. There's a Pac-Man keyboard. <laughs> All this stuff. Fantastic. It's so lemony, Eric. I love it. You know, and it, it, it's funny to me personally that Nemesis Lab, who builds fantastic <laughs> so ironic. equipment, is, so is our ironic. sponsor for this. Uh, <laughs> got about a half full field, it looks like, um, with the. Uh, still got some time to get. To get we still got some survey. time to get in here. Yeah, these guys still got about ten minutes, and then uh, I think we'll see it fill up as we go along. Take a look at the uh, log and see if uh, anyone else has joined. There's a couple people still coming in, so. This is actually the only place that I, you'll probably ever hear me apologize for building really nice stuff. <laughs> I'm point. so sorry. I, I'm, I'm so, so sorry. Oh, <laughs> right, man. Ten minutes here, and we got Judge Phil, so I'm going to pull Judge Phil in here to talk a little bit about when Lemons was at Summit Point. Um, oh, yes. So, let me, uh, like Please do. Phil. Hey, Phil. Uh, can you hear me? Uh, no, not at all. Actually, all, right. Okay. all right, so this is just working. I mean, this stuff is working. Uh, yeah, all right, so I got all my software. Just started iRacing. racing. Uh, I was suggesting that it was from an 1981 Frank Sinatra edition Imperial, not the Chrysler Imperial. It was just an Imperial. Um, that was the one that came with a full suitcase full of eight tracks. Uh, so we were talking about uh, Summit Point, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, so Lemons used to race at the Shenandoah Circuit, which is not the one we're at at the moment. But uh, we did race at this fantastic place in uh, America's favorite backwater, West Virginia. So talk a little bit about what Summit Point was like with Lemons there. Well, so when we would go there, almost every time we went, um, they were having an event, Hyperfest, at the same time at the other track, at this track. And uh, that was essentially toothless 360 pound ex-con hillbillies with pit bulls sort of doing their best uh, imitation of you know shibuya crossing you know 
sort of uh, drifting. And it was always entertaining because people would hop the fence into our race and run across the hot track in order to uh, in order to get to uh, Hyperfest for free without paying the six dollar admission. And so the track facility, you know, we they were trying to stop that. They had what we called human cone. Um, which was people wearing orange who would just stand in the uh, in the facility roads and sort of be cones there. I guess that was cheaper than <laughs> buying cones. Uh, so the whole place, uh, it was open with deer. And I understand, like, you cannot possibly build fences high enough to keep deer out. Um, but we never, as I recall, never had a race without at least one deer getting taken out by a, a race car. And then the drive to the track it was like the the deer apocalypse you just every road would be paved with dead deer deer innards deer heads things that used <laughs> to be inside deer now outside deer um so that was all part of the excitement and one of my least favorite things about seven point was a very tight paddock very small paddock and so we'd have a lot of a lot of angst uh, from racers angry that their neighbors had taken like 1.2 inches of their paddock space everyone had to put their trailers really far away all their their street cars had to be really far away and then throughout all of this there's a steady sort of drumbeat of of very very uh, obese gentlemen without shirts involved somehow with hyperfest kind of staggering through with, you know maybe a bottle of rebel yell whiskey in hand while we're having dudes being separated after, you know, wanting to have fist fights over paddock space. So it was a great Lemons environment, and we had a lot of good times there. There were a lot of hard, concrete things to hit on the track, um, and so we had some excitement with that. Nobody nobody got hurt. Well, we had the one guy, I guess, that we had that crashed where the guy broke his toe. A really good cage, and it was a Volvo. That, so, was a, that was aptly time as a car runs directly into a barrier at yeah. about a, a 1080 on that. So uh, well-timed, Phil. Uh, thank you so much for uh, for jumping in there. Uh, we're we're going to try and do some penalties. Uh, it's, it's hard enough at the moment to kind of keep track of what's happening. So uh, no promises on that. So I found Troy Fru in the number 123 Miata, um, I guess that's our Dance Dance Revolution guy because the car is covered with Dance Dance Revolution arrows and it says Dance Dance Revolution on the hood, so you would think that would be the guy. Yep, that is the guy. That is correct. Driving gas and brake with yeah. literally an on-off switch Dance Dance Revolution map. He's doing, he's so, doing great, by the way. Um, you know, I think, I think our trophy for the Index of Affluency for doing the most with the least uh you know we haven't actually given one out but that's if he finishes the race at all i think he's the shoe in for the very first he was just in the dirt but he didn't hit me oh he's in the dirt again as, yeah. as i'm saying and oh it's, and, and he gets yeah. another yeah <laughs> okay um you were doing really good troy and then it just all went to hell <clears throat> worth pointing out uh chris lemon there on the screen uh lemon's racer who's actual name is chris lemon which is fantastic uh, he's been that a lemons racer for <laughs> I, you know what he raced at nelson's ledges many years ago in tegra which i just saw last year so uh, <laughs> good stuff did he change his name or or was his name that before he got involved that is his christian name yes <laughs> did you name the series after him i'm just yep. trying to that's this correct. is that's yep. my idea of investigative reporting yep Yep, and that's my idea of talking to reporters, so it checks out. It's perfect. Uh, what else is going on? There is a, a driver who made an adjustable set of sliders on a notched uh, pole that turns out to have been a stolen stop sign. I do not remember the gentleman's name. It is absolutely spectacular, though. That, that does save a lot of time drilling holes. Exactly. See, you don't have to, you know, do any kind of machining. Someone's already done that hard work for you. As, uh, I think that's Mark Johns off it. Yeah, we Whatever. don't condone the thievery, but we do admire the effort. Well, you know, Lemons maybe condones the thievery, but, you know. J uh, J officially, officially, you're un <laughs> I was going to say, officially or unofficially, Jay. I'm sorry, not Jay. Uh, I'm just not going to comment on that at all. Who's eating dinner at the moment. Hey, we got Jay. Jay, you there? Yeah, I'm here. Yeah. So what yeah. is our official stance on uh, borrowing road signs for the purposes of race car building 
Oh, well, 100% for it if we don't get caught when you steal them. There we go. What if, it, what if it is really just borrowing? I mean, what if, it, like, I want to see him go put it back. Just, like, shoot the video of him putting it back after using it. That, <laughs> borrowing that makes all the sense the in the world. Well, the difference between borrowing and stealing is, do you still have it where it is not supposed to be when the cops find you? So that's just a, that's just a temporal Who, thing. Whose face is on the 24? Is it Mr. T? Uh, oh, that, so that is... No, it's not Mr. T. Yet. No, it's it is not. Mr. T. Oh, it uh, is. Good, good. To be. So this is Busta Nut Racing, who are famous for having built uh, the, the Rambo six-wheeled pickup truck. Uh, they built a blimp on top of their car, a full, like a 25 foot blimp on top of their Mazda <laughs> MX-6. And then they converted it not to be an A-team vent, but to actually be B.A. Baracus with the big mohawk <laughs> with the face on it. Yes. One of the most spectacular things I've ever seen in Lemons. And these guys are so good at that. Um, so I'm glad to see they've modeled uh, their, their virtual car after that as they pass. Uh, <laughs> I, I pity the fool there. that doesn't get out of the way. I think the window banner is actually gold chains, which is wonderful. Yes, it is. Oh, it's so good. Yes, it is. That's fantastic. <laughs> it's perfect. I cannot remember this gentleman's name. Um, I want to say it's Fritz, but uh, maybe it's not. Frank. Frank Schwartz is his name. That's it. There it is. Frank Schwartz. I uh, he emailed me this week to join the league, and I was so excited to see whatever they brought, and I am not disappointed in that. I see his Schwartz is as big as mine. <laughs> need more space balls themes also uh should mention Absolutely. by the way we'll give our sponsor a good tick here this race is brought to you by the west virginia kangaroo razors incorporated have you thought of owning a kangaroo by west virginia state law you don't need any kind of permit to do so kangaroos make great pets that will only maul you once they're fully grown and that's at least a couple years away municipal and county ordinances may apply oh man <laughs> Uh, I can't talk. I'm, la I'm laughing I know, too much. I know. <laughs> I, I at least made it through the whole read before I think it, my noise gate <laughs> came open. But <laughs> oh West man, Virginia's a hell of a place, man. Yeah. Oh man. And then after the after a couple years after it wants to box, then it's tiger food. So you know you're good to go. Yeah, yeah. I, if they don't have rules against the kangaroo, I can't imagine they have any kind of governing big cats. You know. And West Virginia is kind of like Australia, in a way. Yeah, it's definitely lawless up there. I was going to say, what is it? The no claw, no law? Is that what's going on in West Virginia? <laughs> <laughs> Something like that. Nice. Pretty much. Should mention that the Lemons Rally has been through West Virginia several times and is always Excellent. one of my favorite and least favorite sections of the rally for uh, <laughs> for reasons that you will know if you've ever been there. All right, Colton Mary uh, is is set the fastest lap in this session so far in his uh, beautiful street stock Camaro. Is that Colton on the hood of that car? And what is this disturbing trend with giant smiling faces that take up the entire front end of the car? <laughs> That's the Flex Seal guy. That is actually the Flex Seal guy. Yes. <laughs> Dear sweet Lord. It's, it's, you know, I think it's about intimidating the people that are looking in their mirror. Uh, the uh, the driver of the Mirthmobile from last week told me he was scared to death with the street stocks with the faces on them when that coming down the straightaway. He said it was very. <laughs> he said he, he said giant he had, mouth on the front end. He had uh, bad dreams for a couple days after that race. He told me. <laughs> uh, shout out to Mike Goff, Go Goff, whatever. Uh, attempting to race again this week. Uh, Good for him. Bob Harnsberger, also Lemons Racer from Colorado, who's built some spectacular stuff uh, getting in on here as we uh, kick off the grid. What's the chance we can get a Randy Bish uh, health update? Oh, yeah, uh, that's worth covering. You know, <laughs> one of the, <laughs> one of the big, yeah. one of big things happening this week is uh, Randy Bish, uh, perhaps the early favorite for Lemons iRacer of the year. Uh has decided that uh, anybody who donates to any charity this week, um, for every donation individually, he will take a shot uh, throughout the night, uh, beginning long before the race. So uh, we're at, uh, I don't know, probably hour three of uh, Randy 
Randy's pre-race prep. So uh, last I knew, he had 11 shots lined up, and that was like Tuesday. So uh, could be could be pretty entertaining uh, wherever he's at uh, mentally and uh, in virtual space. And knowing Randy, that's 11 on top of the normal amount of however many. So it's right. he sent a serious message south to the liver. I'm sure the message has been received. I see that Randy is if anyone can get in touch with Randy, we'd really like to know. Is are you okay? I can see he was in this session at one point. Uh, according is, to the yep. gr- according to the grid, we do have forty eight cars that join the session, so we'll have to see how many we actually have on track. But uh, this is going to be exciting. It'll be something. Um, should point out that this weekend we have the cat on a Roomba in a shark suit carousel as our official track corner uh, so we'll get a good look at that at some point that is the famous carousel that is modeled in west virginia fashion after the nurburgrings carousel i did find randy but it seems like he might not be in the session his name is in here but he he doesn't seem to be here not surprising given the state of uh of eye racing at the moment which is you know anytime lemons gets involved in anything this is kind of an inevitability i i hate to be that guy but isn't the carousel on the other track we got in this um dave boland points leader my neighbor and also wearing a very awesome uh sonor card gauge livery from a homestar runner if you're a homestar <laughs> runner fan uh you'll get that one also Cat on, the on a Roomba. Trunk. In the house. I'm sorry, I can't stop laughing. It's on the screen right now. <laughs> I apologize. And yeah, Jay, the car- the actual carousel is on the other track, but we've christened. I think it's turned five. The baby carousel over here. Yeah. So here we are. It here has we are. a little bit of carousel here. We are. There we are. <laughs> the cat's going to the wrong dire- in the wrong direction, but you guys get the idea. <laughs> the idea. Well, the idea is nobody's going to end up going in the right direction. Anyway, okay. So. so it will become accurate at that point. It, exactly. Here's us in our cord ga- card gauge, mort gauge on the back deck, and Trogdor spitting uh, Pontiac emblems on the hood, which is fantastic. And the best name in the race, by far. Oh, Burn- our, our single file has just gone to pot. It's, it's out. It's gone. Well, it worked really well on the first race that didn't end up broadcast. So, you know, it was a good idea in theory. We're doing a single file start this week. Attempting, anyway. It's uh, single file is, is that no, whoa, whoa, wait a minute. Everybody just got back in line. Holy crap. I don't believe what I'm seeing. Oh, and now they're out there. They're not in line anymore. Well, you gotta, you gotta race for seventh place. <laughs> now, straight. now the race hasn't started and we're four wide on the front stretch. <laughs> Why not? We'd like to start the race as single. No, we will start the race as single file unless you don't want to. Looks like that we're underway without anybody. Uh, we haven't uh, gotten to turn one yet, Eric. Yeah, you're correct. You're correct. <laughs> That's what happens when Eric's presumptuous there, maybe. Yeah. Oh, somebody didn't slow down. <laughs> that was yeah. a revolution. <laughs> that was dance dance. <laughs> Just wide open throttle into the trees. Oh, man. The, uh, the up button not working for oh, very the well. The up button has failed him. <laughs> Go back and pick now, up the now he's uh, A-class have to his feet, dude. Down, down, left, right, left, right, up, up, down. Yes, I'm basically reciting a Nintendo cheat code. <laughs> on board with uh, that's, that's car reset. On board with the Class A leader Norbert Sabatko in a Mustang this week, guys. Uh, it'll be interesting to watch these faster cars cut up through the field. That should lead for uh, some good quality entertainment for the folks at home. Coming into the cat on a Roomba carousel. And Sabatka dra- piloting the Sobieski Vodka number 36 Mustang. And uh, speaking of Sobieski Vodka, if anybody is anywhere near Harpersville, Alabama right now, please bring me something to drink. I'm thirsty. No gin and tonic Sobieski from the wife Vodka this week? literally passing Duff Beer on track with Corona right behind him. Come on, y'all. This is, this is exactly what Lemon's should be in virtual spaces. There's a uh, good kerfuffle up ahead of Norbert there. What just... piece of all of it, I guess. Oh, my. I love you for saying kerfuffle. Oh, there's a John Deere Solstice. Love. The student driver Miata's out there. The number 444 student driver uh, Somebody's Miata. on fire in the pits. That's always good to see. 
one lap into the race. <laughs> Pretty sure that's the dance dance car that like ended oh, up in an oak tree. Oh, oh we, we had an over. We got an old Oh my god. god! Up into an oak tree. That was beautiful. If, if we someone in this session could please figure out which car that was, I will yeah, I will get that on replay. I think that was the student driver car. I think that was the four forty four, I think. Alright, stand by stand by for, for quality entertainment on the replay. That was mega pit maneuver by by a Jetta that's running like uh, third right now or something. Which which car is the student driver? I picked up the wrong one. Oh, the four forty four. I okay. think. Okay. Oh yeah, here we go on camera. Yes. <laughs> one good more. Old boy. <laughs> one more time. This time from on board. I'm gonna pull Jay in here and ask Jay how great he feels that this is happening in virtual space. That'd be oh, space. hang so, on, everybody. So it's going to be a bumpy ride. Like, Woo! okay, going through the tree, going through the tree. And you know what? He's not dead. Not my problem. <laughs> <laughs> Howard Dean approves. <laughs> Howard Dean definitely approves of that. Do we have Howard? Is Howard here in the booth with us this week? <laughs> oh, Howard. <laughs> I'm I'm disappointed with Howard. I can make the Howard noise. People are right. playing it in their head. I'm Battle okay for with... the lead here. David Beland in the Solstice leading the way. Here comes Simon Thorpe in that Jetta. Another Solstice for David Bryan running in third. Nick Dacuzzi in fourth. And Frank Schwartz round out your top five. Battle for the lead headed into the Cat on a Roomba carousel here momentarily. Simon Thorpe, by the way, part of the Bernal Dads, who have raced in Lemon since 2008, I believe. They have a Volvo wagon that is done up like uh, Run DMC Adidas. Fantastic stuff. And Bland doing the, the wise thing, getting out of Simon Thorpe's way there, because uh, Thorpe has literally pit maneuvered his way to the <laughs> to the front of this field, uh, literally sending a Miata through a tree a lap or so ago. It was uh, it was majestic. Terrifying. It was majestic. Terrifying, but I majestic. think he I think he earned some of those mandatory pilot training hours tonight already, guys. Yeah, we I can will this uh, actually count with the FAA towards flight hours? Absolutely. If you do things like that. Okay. Absolutely. So this and Microsoft out. Flight should point out the Jetta wearing a San Francisco public transport transport livery, as Judge Phil points out in our uh, in our chat. We'll have Judge Phil back on in just a couple minutes, I think. Which uh, which right. car is that? <laughs> That's the uh, the leader, Simon Thorpe's car. Oh. There's also a cup of noodles. Uh, oh, Miata out there. Let's take it. Let's Ryan take it. Gregory rightly pointing out in chat that that Miata is now stanced. <laughs> It's it would be a cube, I think, at this point. Can we get a check on a Troy Frew's status? He's at. He is. Oh, there's multiple Troys. Troy is back in forty first. Uh, he's moving. on the racetrack. He's moving. Can we get? Oh, and uh, oh. the student driver Miata also. Oh, carnage! Oh, that's not good. Carnage! That's not good at all. See if we can get. We definitely got a replay of that one too. That is the forty six of Matt Fox. And the 77 of Darren Belcourt. Let's take a look at the replay now. Here they come down the straightaway. Oh, oh Belcourt yeah, yeah. in the grass. I hate to see it. Just lost it in the grass. Or, or, um, do you, or do you love to see it? That's the question. Uh, here, here it's not bad. <laughs> That's I like a, your optimism. That Miata is looking pretty rough there. Can we get a can we get half a lap on board with Troy as he struggles with the dance dance pad? I think that's probably worth doing, right? Absolutely. We have people giving you a little grief about the Transpit Authority, and then someone pointing out that the uh, Transpit Authority is the New York Transit system. Ah, uh, Troy tried to take a shortcut and it didn't work out, guys. He's gonna yeah. he's, he's gonna have to reboot three times and come back. <laughs> we'll try it. We'll we'll come back and uh, pick it up. He's gonna be towing for a minute here, so we'll go back now and see if we can check in on our leader, Pit Maneuver, Mister Mister uh, Excuse me, Mister Pit Maneuver himself. Going Simon through the is, Simon's sort of running away a little bit, but uh, Mister Sabatko in the uh, in the vodka Mustang is uh hot pursuit to catch him yeah he's he's gonna run him down fairly easily coming um, into the cat on a Roomba back. carousel it's coming into the cat on a Roomba carousel and in between the leader and the second place car is the miami vice sponsored solstice it's still um, so it's good. still funny that is very don johnsony those colors very pastel very nice 
That's Don Johnson from Ohio. That is. And I love the uh, the four shades of brown Miata that's in between them right now. That's it makes me want Hershey's and it makes me want coffee all at the same time. It's very odd. Uh, Mr. Sparkle again. Always good to see. Mr. Mr. Sparkle. Sparkle. There's the uh, Corona <laughs> Corona Miata right behind the Mr. Sparkle. And uh, that was bad. So, yeah, there we go. Oh, Kim Jong Un. Is that Kim Jong Un on the hood of the 51? Let's take a look. Yes, it is. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Who is that? Oh, that is Troy Ekber Eckenberg, or Toby Eckenberg. It's nuclear-powered Ek crow pants. Crow paints. To Toby Eckenberg, not a lemons racer, who for, but definitely in the spirit of things. That's excellent. <laughs> oh, glorious leader. All right, Number let's 51. see. Let's see if uh, Troy is moving again. No, he's still in the pits. <laughs> We'll keep checking in on, on our Dance Dance Revolution friend, uh, driving with the Dance Dance Revolution pedals. Oh, pile up in turn one. Mr. Sparkle getting the Kim Jong-un punt in turn one. Does the, the, oh, does the Miata? Nope, the Miata does not rejoin in front of Kim Jong. I was really hoping the Miata was going to get the better of the uh, of Imperious Leader, but nope, didn't happen. You know, so Dave, my wife was making a weird face at me. I had to show her the Kim Jong Un one more time. That's pretty excellent. <laughs> yeah. They hate us because they aim us, Dave. <laughs> I'm really, I'm, I'm so excited that people are taking this unseriously in the right ways with the the bad control surfaces and the great paint jobs. I mean, that's you know, what this is really all about. You know, we 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 talk. I don't remember if it was last week or uh, since then, but we we wanted to test out the mouse driving theory, and it it works surprisingly well. Yeah, yeah. I, uh, I think at some point we're gonna have to have a mouse only. Yeah, um, yeah mou mouse <laughs> mouse only race. That should be. We can make it at Irwindale the figure eight. I think that would be important. We could do you know as many cars as they'll let us have out there, and we'll just do a figure eight mouse race. I'm I'm a big fan of that front wheel drive on the. Uh, we'll do that yes. the Jetta. So, the sounds good to me. Uh, another good option is the uh, the National Impala, the Arkham Menards car, because it has the new damage model. Pieces fly off, hoods fly up, all that kind of stuff. So. Excellent. Yeah, we'll have to file that one away for a rainy day, too. So we see a Sab Sabatko has taken over the lead, and uh, on his tail there, it uh, doesn't look like it's four position, but uh, another interesting-looking car with another face that, on it. Yeah, I don't know who that is, but uh, it's it's disturbing. That might be Nate Schlevine or Phil Couturier. They both had uh, similar faces painted on there. Yeah, roll back in the field and take a really good look at the hood of the number 333. Aaron this is getting Sloan more and more car. disturbing. <laughs> yes, it gets closer. That's, and it's literally He's trying to take screen. a bite out of that spoiler. <laughs> <laughs> Who the hell? Old, old, old Spice. spice car. Yep. Old, old Spice. That's uh, Schlavine. Good call. Get a good look at that machine. God, you couldn't <laughs> script that. How perfect. So, I'm so happy. I'm passing a Mustang. I'm, I'm so, so hungry. Happy. I'm at least so happy to be behind the Mustang because Mustang won't run you over when you're behind it. But <laughs> looks like they're uh, headed into the cat on a Roomba in a shark suit carousel. And that's when the Mustang says, "Hold my beer and brake check you." <laughs> this is never going to get old. <laughs> oh. <Seriously. laughs> oh. That was actually almost skillful. That was like nice that was like that was like watching a race. Where where are we? Is this real life? Uh, you know, no part of West Virginia feels like real life. I think that's the most important thing to know if you've never been there. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> I, I that is Phil Couture here, I believe. Uh no. I'm not no, sure it's, now. it's it's yeah, it's, 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 it's definitely yeah. Shlevine, and it's very definitely disturbing. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's Nate on the on the hood, but I'm not positive. Well, Nate, mission mm -hmm. accomplished. Yep. Yep. Let's see if we can find uh, some other uh, good-looking machines out let's here. Let's take a look at Aaron Slowman in the Triple uh, Three. I like the move over. <laughs> I like the the keep six feet away and on the front of the car, and the hood is is wonderful. Aaron Slowman. Uh, there goes the. <laughs> That was the uh, the the Dance Dance Revolution car just bend it again. <laughs> Look at like, the, the move time bend over forty four caliveried for Mr. Ryan Stevens. 
looking the, uh, for the, the slow man. The Dance Revolution car literally just bend it again, and it's, this time it was digital, digital death. There's no way around it. It was bad. <laughs> <laughs> well, thank goodness for unlimited fast repairs, as I'm still looking for slow men. I need oh oh three there. three 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 thirty three. Looks like he's off the track. And That's his brother Brett. Oh there's, my fault, my a, fault. There is another. There is another. <laughs> there are multiple slow men in this race. Let's see if here. Let's get let's get back to a so car that is on track. Is, uh, and I'll find the actual slowman here. Sorry. Here we go. Second place. Here we go. Thank you. That was very helpful. Oh, what on earth is on? Oh, that's the COVID. Yeah. Oh, there you it, go. oh, 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 too soon, too soon. And uh, Matt Slavine just chimed in and said that is indeed Nathan on the hood. Thank you, Matt, for that information. We appreciate that. Yeah, I'm not doing a, I'm not doing a good service here and watching chat. Thank you, uh, Yoder, for pointing that out. Appreciate that. Uh, Blackhawk Motorsports pointing out that West Virginia is 20 years behind every state. I don't know if you've been there in the last 10 years. It's at least 40. Yeah, well, you know, optimism, maybe. I do love it, though. It's pretty. Oh, yeah. It's, it's really nice roads, too. Yes, for sure. I don't mean like not potholed. I just mean like really curvy and mountain curvy and potholed. mountain roads. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> totally. I'm with you. Uh, looks like there's an incident headed into the cat on a Roomba in a shark suit carousel. There, the cat's adding things as we go. The cat's actually putting on <laughs> on costumes and clothing as we go. Is that what's happening there? Well, he's in a shark suit. He's in, in a shark suit. You can't see it, unfortunately, Yoder, but uh, it's there. I, pro I assure you. <laughs> okay, that's awesome. <laughs> you know, I actually, I think I can put it on the on the main screen for you guys too, at least uh, here in the booth, so you get an idea of that. But yeah, I don't think that's ever going to get old. <laughs> yeah, I don't know if that's sped, if that's sped up, but I do enjoy the speed of that uh, GIF. It doesn't matter. It's the oh, internet. It's the what word. is truth anyway? Right. Uh, let's get a look at Bob Harnsberger. Right. I know this is the first time he's ever used iRacing ever, so he that's may be in the pits. That's amazing. Uh, looks like he is moving. We found him. He's uh, getting doored by a Jetta as he blinked. I think he blinked. Oh, broadcaster's yeah, curse. Lost. He just blinked out. Worth pointing out that Bob Harnsberger's uh, race car is a Renault Le Car that he took a flood totaled Infinity I-30 and took the motor out of it and put it in the back to make a ghetto Renault R5 turbo out of it. And it is <laughs> fast, actually. That's that impressive. That is absolutely terrifyingly amazing. Yeah, it'll. I think Phil took it to the drag strip and ran mid fourteens in it. Uh, <laughs> mid fourteens with a with a forty two with a Lemons nice. car. Yeah, yeah, fifteens. He says. I, yeah, uh, and he almost crashed it because it all the weights in the back. But he built it, and it's great. It'd be even better if it was chain drive. If we've had chain drive cars before. Hello, Matthew. Hello, Matthew Cox that, from yeah. South Carolina. Low from North Carolina. Yeah, we're, uh, jump into the chat and let us know where you're watching this from. Besides uh, your home and or the sad place. <laughs> the sad place. Uh, should we, are we, we going to start watch? talking about the before times? Yes. <laughs> Give it a year. All right, I have some good news. Troy is moving and we're on board. Troy's on the track. Look at that. He's even racing what looks vaguely like a racing line, although he's got a warning light on the dash. Is he on gas? It's alternator light, I, I think, is uh, what that okay. is. Yeah, no, actually, it says fuel 0, 0.0. I think that's just a, a product of spectating, I believe. These races aren't long enough to run out of gas. <laughs> well, it would take extra well, talent to use up all the gas in the car within the short amount of time. Troy Frew completing a lap. Good yes. lord. Yes, on board again. Just yes, yes. We need to just go on board or or like follow Troy for a full lap just to see what the the light switch on off brake pedal and gas pedal is like. I'm just very curious. All right, we're we're on board. I'm gonna put the camera up on the windshield so we can get a nice view of what he's seeing. That's again. He's running what vaguely resembles a racing lot. Here we go. Don't Here. curse him. Don't, there we go. Don't no, that's a good. That's a good looking I, shot right there. There we go. I like you moving the camera around while the race is going on. Like you're yes. standing up in the car. <laughs> like you're standing hey, up in the I car have holding robots. a GoPro. I have robots that's that awesome. do that do my bidding. That's right. We have people watching from uh, Turkey, 
for nice. most people. Apparently, uh, Dolphin Island, Alabama. Nice. I know where that is. The South, Dolphin's nice. South Jersey. Uh, you know, Tulsa? You know, I've been to Tulsa many times in the last year. That's a long Shout story. Shout out to Gil- for a longer Gil- race. Is it Gillette, Wisconsin? Gillette or Gillette? I'm thinking Gillette. Gillette? I'm Gillette. 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 Oh, yeah, there are the two. Best, Burlington, the Iowa. Island can get. Yeah. Ooh, an island in Alabama. That's got to be a party. That's Dauphin Island, yeah. Dauphin's actually nice. And uh, Alexander Fulcher is watching from Wuhan, South Jersey. Uh, Washington, D.C. <laughs> there, Jonathan. Shout out. Um, let's see here. What else we got? South Dakota, Morganton, West Virginia. Robbie Wilson in the house, everybody. Hey, hey, he just he's just up the road seven hours. That's great. Ringworm, actually, it's four Alabama. I'm actually, I'm in Alabama. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Ringworm plus Alabama as a northerner. That's oh right. yeah, no, it's just saying. Uh, Lazard, we're also rocking the party over on the uh, Lemons Twenty Four Hours of Lemons Facebook page as well, uh, where you can if, where you can also tune in. He's uh, was commenting on the viewers, and we're we're carrying a solid uh, about three hundred viewers right now. I think they're there. Oh, there we go. Oh, there we go. That is nice. Oh. <laughs> that is it's the same corner every. T- he can't get it. He just can't get it. Like. like that's oh, wonderful. And uh, hey, uh, F, F's in chat for Troy, everyone. Capital F's for Troy. <laughs> I would like to point out that Ringworm is actually commenting in YouTube from inside one of my Greyhounds in Alabama, which is not easy to do, but congratulations. Fair enough. There we go. Good. Are we just going to get a flyby? I feel like if we get us just a static cam of the... <laughs> the uh, the kitty litter as the car blows right through it. Be cool. <laughs> Watching the <laughs> it's dance tense. Oh no! Oh, rearranging no. the face of a Miata. <laughs> stand stand so by great. stand by for the uh, the, uh, the the money shot. <laughs> I'm sorry, that's too funny. At some uh, point, Randy Randy Bish is allegedly somewhere in this race. I don't know if he's actually did he did he re- down, so did I don't he, think he ever started. I was gonna say, did he did he reconnect? I don't think he ever got got in um which sucks we'll have to we'll have to get a hold of him at some point that's a lot of f's in chat guys a lot of s r.i.p uh, uh rest in peace tony there was a uh, here we go on board on board f. on board it's not even an attempt Ooh. to smoke <laughs> 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 I mean, not even it's not oh, like he, he mounted the tire the barrier excellent excellent oh. <laughs> most excellent yeah the All problem right. is that car is not fast enough to hit the wall like that. <laughs> it shouldn't be going. Apparently, that fast right he there. went to hit the brake pedal at the end of the straightaway and hit the wrong button, and uh, jived when he should have juked, but it didn't work out unfortunately. But again, he's, he's going to blame it on the the <laughs> the button switched on him. That's a lot of F's in chat. The thank you, gassed. thank the you, thank you, chat for for your support for for Troy, and we'll we'll check back in with him later and see how he's doing. Worth uh, worth mentioning that Troy Frew is part of the the vaunted Sputnik crew out of uh, the D.C. area, which is not far <laughs> the point. Uh, Troy has been part of many incredibly bad efforts. Uh, Plymouth Fury among them. Uh, a Porsche 924 with a Nissan 1.6 liter Sentra motor swapped in it for some godforsaken Ooh. reason. Uh, go to the lead. Go to the lead. There's a hell of a battle going on. Mm-hmm. There, there's actual racing going We're on. There. That's weird. We've been there, we've been there for it. like a lap. Yeah, these guys oh are my duke, God. duking it out. Get I don't understand the... this, so I'm going to turn it over to you guys. For... <laughs> <laughs> you don't know how to talk. There's just actual race craft being employed right now. Yep. And Eric's like, nope, can't do it. No, I got I got an empty, so I got to go remedy that. Ah, you're good. You're good. Take your time. Yeah, we got a hot battle here heating up. Sabatko leading the way with Cotier running in second in that uh, white, red, and blue street stock, making a run here down the straightaway. That's, a, that's, the, most, uh, that's the most Camaro-y Volkswagen I've ever seen in my entire it, it, life. It's a, beautiful, it's a beautiful. It's a project car. You know, one of those things that you can order in the mail, and then you assemble it yourself, and cre- let creati- creativity take over. Is that, uh, is that the... Oh, I'm trying to get a good read on the hood here. Uh, I thought it was like a United States Postal Service for a second. Here is the battle for the lead. They were going to be heading towards the, uh, the hard left-hander with the kitty litter. Oh, this... I don't think this is going to work out. Oh, the... The street stock mounting the Mustang. You, you, you don't ever see that, folks. And uh, and that is priority fail racing, actually, instead of priority mail. Ah, perfect. <laughs> this colors make a lot of sense now, too. Into the cat on a Roomba in a shark costume carousel. Sabatko Lee continues to lead the way, doing a fantastic job tonight. Uh, 
I'm really impressed with uh, what he's been able to do so far, and uh, it's going to be interesting watching these two guys work their way through this traffic right here, Yoder. And uh, as we see three wide in front, oh, the leader is going to get caught up here with a Mustang. We're off. We're doing agricultural hey, uh, agricultural racing, and they're back at did it. I miss anything? Battle miss for anything? the lead again after uh, after uh, an interesting uh, gaggle of cars that they worked their way through. Oh, Mustang to pit oh, road. Oh no! Oh, I hate to see Sabat get pulled off like that. That that's terrible. Katoria, he had his eyes up. He saw what was going on in front of him. He saw that the fact that it was that that was just nasty. That little bit of a off that uh, Sabatko had with that Miata and the pick was set and Couturier took advantage of it and uh, that concludes our actual racing for the <laughs> evening. <laughs> it was short lived but it was entertaining. Yeah, I mean there was a, a, a nice little bit of contrast to our entertainment to see some competition taking place also. Uh, yeah, the I would like to point out that was a that was a full lap plus of real racing. Yes, it was. It was it, amazing. It was it will surely be clipped by many and cherished That's by probably everyone. why uh, why I was very confused. I'm totally unfamiliar with this concept. Well, the, the nice thing about the internet, you have the ability to go back and watch it and, and learn. Mm. It's nice, and uh, just like Cole Trickle said, it's amazing what you can learn from Jason watching. Davis in the chat pressing F for an orbit. <laughs> Thank you, Jason. Uh, phone, number, like phone, numbers being phone numbers being posted in the chat looks like. No, no, that was the lap count. At the oh, the lap race. count. Yes, yes, yes. We, uh, we, uh, we, like, we, like we mentioned, uh, the, some of the race officials like to partake a little bit, and they uh, weren't sure how many laps we were going to be able to run tonight. So sometimes that takes a little bit of uh, time to uh, extrapolate and calculate. So uh, that's why you see that at the beginning of the race. So good times. Uh, the YouTube user, as soon as pasteable pizza, asking who else is having hot pockets for dinner. Uh, press F for. YouTube user as soon as paste pizza. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. I'm having pizza in a cup. Ooh, and if thanks. anyone gets that reference, congratulations. I don't, I don't know that reference, but I'm just going to roll with it. Rude watched all of Senna cup. focused on Alan Prost's shoe selection. Correct. Correct. Nice. nice. If you are going for a gap that doesn't, you know, I don't know the quote. <laughs> I heard a lemons racer use it once. I think told it's him to leave. It's um, if you don't go for if you don't if you don't go for a gap, then you're not racing. I think is what the, the something to that effect. I think in in this we we flip that, and it's only go for gaps that don't exist. I think that's I think that's right. <laughs> and always put good. salt in your eyes. There's another reference. Only I'm gonna get. I believe that. Anton Gurov and Anton Lovett are both in this race, which must be the only race with two Antons outside of <laughs> Russia that has ever happened. <laughs> Anton Gurov here in the... Uh, is he in the student driver? Yes. He's ah, the student he's driver. Yes. And hey, Anton... What do you know? The race is over. That's oh, weird. Oh, I thought it was on the... <laughs> <I> thought, oh. <laughs> <laughs> We're, let's find the other Anton before before we lose the opportunity to get both Antons exposure. The, the other race, I'm not. Oh, totally okay, right. okay. I got excited. I was like, maybe, man, two, two, maybe I miss two I Antons in one league. That's that's impressive. It is impressive. Uh, Anton uh, Gurov, by the way, races for the Boston Winers, which is a great name. There's Troy Fru. Yes, poor Troy. Poor Troy. I don't. I I think he showed pretty well. He ran at least two laps. Oh yeah, which which is more than I think we expect. <laughs> I want to know, like, I saw him go just balls out off in turn one at least three times. Like, what like was that. happening in the braking zone or leading up to the braking zone of turn one, where it was like literal, like I don't even remember being on a racetrack and just pff, straight to a wall. We're here at the end of the front straightaway. Uh, I was expecting to see some demolition derby take place, but uh, so far. No one has partaken. Hmm. And I believe Judge Phil, because of the two Antons in this race, is now receiving a bribe from Conrad Putin, which is <laughs> unexpected. That's what does. Blackhawk huh. Motorsports asks, can you do longer races? 18 laps is too little. Yeah, I think that's in the plans. Um, so at the moment, we have season one scheduled out for... Thursday nights with the final race of the season. Oh, there goes somebody ramping off, by the way. Ah, um, I'll find I, it. They've made it to D.C. in the air, which is impressive. Um, it, yeah, so we're going to run next week as scheduled. We might make 
couple small adjustments. After that, we may start adding some longer races, uh, some different formats, things like that. So we, we are oh. thinking about those things. Yes. Mr. JP Sparkle. Murray. Yep. Mr. Sparkle getting some air. Still got some other. Oh. Oh. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Tyler Dacuzzi. That's That was talent. Let's see Put if we can orbit. Let's let's go on board with Tyler for that. That seemed that was amazing. Oh, we see it there in the background. He got it. <laughs> wow, that was an impressive amount of air. Let's see if we can uh, capture that on the onboard camera before we. Uh... We need someone to figure out how to get one of the iRacing physics breakdowns where it's a literal like moonshot. All right, guys. If you've never seen one of those, it's wonderful. On board now with Tyler. Cue the, cue the. You know, you know what's going. You know what's coming. Wow, they're taking turns. Incredible. Uh oh. <laughs> barrel roll. That Do was a, a barrel roll. I need that. I, I that need was that wonderful. Clip. I'm yes. impressed because that that setup right there says to me that that Tyler spent a reasonable amount of the practice sessions this week setting that up to to end the race that way, and that nice. tells me his mind's in the right place. That's that's right. It's, it's absolutely right. Should point out he races a fear. That explains to you everything so, you need to know. That tells you everything yeah. you need to know. <laughs> Man, let's let's take a look and see if uh, see if we can find out uh, what's what's to come here in the next few minutes. <sighs> quality, Things quality entertainment. And stuff. Yeah, yes. it's it's that was that was interesting. Yes. Did, is I racing still 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 struggling? Yes, it looks like it is. Of like course it. it is. Well, we'll get there. Yep, the site itself is now not wanting to load for me. Dirt daring. Uh, it's talking about flying Miatas. It's wonderful. That is wonderful. I don't think flying Miata actually um, meant that. <laughs> like that flying actual... Miata, same yeah. as the crowd attacking Mustangs. Stunting and exploding. All right, come on. Stunting and exploding is our uh, rule to keep people from doing this in the paddock, which, ironically, was formed at a race at Summit Point. So <laughs> there may have been some extracurricular partying that was problematic. So, uh, yeah. Well, Fitting, I suppose. That's understandable. Yes, uh, Jim, we're, uh, we're working on that right now. Grind and Hydra is the league open. I want in on this. Yeah, yeah. it's uh, what is it? I suck at racing dot com. Is that correct? Yeah, yeah. There you go. That is correct. Yeah. And, yeah, and if you're an iRacing member too, you can also search in the league directory for twenty four hours of lemons. That is true. Although you still have to email us to get into the league. Just yeah. If you're if you're curious in. about uh, the schedule and stuff like that, you can check it out. So, but yes. I suck at racing.com. You see the graphic there in the lower right of the screen right now. Waiting for the member site. Oh, service unavailable. Well, momentarily, we'll uh, be, uh, yeah. Yep, good times. Party time, excellent. That's right. Yeah, high racing having some struggles with us uh, running Lemons races, turns out. It happens. There are a lot of people on the internet right now. It's, it's understandable. It's, uh... Let's see if Jay is still hanging around. Jay, are you still listening to this nonsense? Oh, yeah, I'm here. I mean, what else would I be doing? That's kind of where this whole thing yeah. started, yeah. right? <laughs> that has been the genesis of Lemons I racing, in fact. Yeah, at, or, so, you know, Lemons. Cool. At, yeah, at Lemons. All. Yeah, Lemons, just just flat, plain Lemons. Oh, yeah, no, no, I listened, I listened to that whole thing, and I was duly impressed. Yeah, yeah, and by that you mean... Uh, on your second scotch, I would guess. Yeah. I am, so. yeah, yeah, I, I'm at four, but. Duly, I was duly impressed. Like, ha head in hand, shaking scotch. Like, you can hear the ice cube shaking around in the ga glass the whole time. Yeah. I want to actually take the opposite view here and just say that for a guy with a Dance Dance Revolution console, he was doing great. I that mean, where do you, yeah, where do you get off criticizing him for only hitting the wall four times? I so, think that's that's he only lawn darted the car through the wall four times. He hit it much more than that. I would point out that that was in the same location every time, which means that just happens to be a one where he has to get his left foot like across the right foot and then back. It's just clearly something he couldn't do. 
If this were real life, he would already have a peg welded to his roof. I don't know who you yeah. are, what you've done yeah. with Jay. <laughs> <laughs> I take, a, I take a very liberal and open-handed view when they can't actually kill themselves. They can crash as much as they want. Nice. They took our internets, Donnie. That's what's going on. They took our it, internets. It does seem like eye raising has a... Hmm. Which one are we trying to get into now? The Charlie sessions? The Charlie session would be the late race. We'll see if it'll actually work here. I'm still stuck on the... Error five oh four service unavailable. Go back to the the uh, load screen, like like just type iRacing into the browser and go back to your your loading screen and retype in all your stuff. That's what I had to do. Works like a glove. Works eighty percent of the time, every time. Every time. Was it Sex Panther? <laughs> iRacing it makes the twenty four hours. <laughs> Go for it. I said I racing makes the 24 hours of lemons seem like a well-oiled organized machine, <laughs> which is really not a compliment. We won't tell anyone. We're but better organized. Wait, maybe we will. Tracks. All right. Wreckfest is coming up in the chat again. Nice. Maybe we need to look into that, Jay. I don't know. I think I think we do. In fact, I'm bringing it up right now. You what really, was the, you what was really the story? Need what was the story with the insurance and the the bus demolition derby, Jay? <laughs> well, the story was they didn't tell us they were doing a bus demolition derby the week before our Flat Rock race, and. <laughs> um, when we got there, was it? I think it was Toledo. No, it was Toledo. And when we got there the week after they had done their bus demolition derby, there was a nine foot gaping hole in the wall on the front street where a bus had gone <laughs> through it. And he's like, oh, we're going to put up some pylons. It's going to be fine. Like, no, and people can see it. So, yeah, we had to actually build a retaining wall in 12 hours before we could do the race. So I opened uh, the story I was expecting. That's better. wow. Yeah, so was one where, looks fabulous. God, what was the one where you had to call the insurance about something or like? Oh, oh yeah, no, that was. Oh, that was because. Uh, yeah, what did we call it? We called some race the something something demo derby. Uh, oh, the, it was like the Kentucky demo derby. The Kentucky demo derby, right? No, exactly. And yeah, we got the call. We got the call back from the insurer. It said so. Is this the one with the buses or just without the buses? We're like, wait, what? <laughs> what? You sent us an insurance policy what, for a real demo derby? And, you know, the fascinating thing is a real demo derby, I'm really no more expensive to insure than a 24 hours lemons race. I, I would like to go ahead and point out that in Wreckfest, we can have a bus demo derby and you don't have to worry about insurance. So let's go ahead and do that. I'm looking at Wreckfest right now, and it's looking really good. Yes, it is. <laughs> yes, it is. We can have lawnmower demo derbies. We can have motorized couch demo derbies. We can have caravan demo derbies. Oh, it's just it's it's everything you want it to be. I promise. Loading well, I into I'm Charlie. Yeah. Yeah. Loading oh, in. What's now. really wonderful is when you have like one of the open cockpit, like a lawnmower, and you hit something head on, and it just it ragdoll ejects the driver <laughs> into space. Wow! It's oh, it's just great. Oh baby, it, I, this is just Jay, a no-brainer. Jay's either going to have the best dreams in the world tonight or yeah. the worst. I'm not sure. Oh. Which. No, this is looking spectacular. I think those are the same. I think those are the same dreams, actually. Well, when you run lemons, you have weird dreams, and I can speak to that firsthand. Yeah. Especially yeah. if you've been at a race all day, like for ten hours, listening to Hondas rip by uh, with you know the 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 cherry bomb exhaust. So you get this kind of resonating in your head that doesn't go away, and you go to bed with that. Your dreams are super weird in a way that you can never explain to anybody. I'm, hey. I'm loading right now, and you did see that. I mean, I sent you pictures of the E21 is up on a rack. It's getting worked on. We're we're coming. We're it's coming out. And good news, it does have a cherry bomb on it, 
It's 1.8 liters of fury, and you can't really hear the exhaust over the lifter tank. So we're going to fit right in. That sounds amazing. And speaking of fury, tonight's broadcast hey, brought to you on Bearded Fury. Thank you to Top Flight Computers. You said That's fury. Right. It was a good a good segue. I like it. So this is the uh, the Charlie session, by the yes. way, which is a six minutes designed as an overflow session. It's a non points race, but uh, the points don't actually matter much like all of this racing. It's just a place for people to maybe Randy Bish it a little bit with some booze and, <laughs> and hop in a virtual race car. H have we been able to get a, get a hold of Randy? Yeah, uh, let me poke around here. Talk amongst yourselves. Oh, yeah. So I'm, I'm going to go ahead right now in between these races, mention uh, these broadcasts also brought to you by Nemesis Lab. Uh, we build really, really, really nice simulation and gaming hardware, and this is the only place on the planet, like Jay forced me to do earlier, where I'm going to say, I'm sorry it's so nice. <laughs> but if you're looking for simulation hardware, please look us up, www.nemesislab.com. Thank we you. We would love to talk to you guys. Thank you, Lazard. We have a Randy Bish sighting. He's leaving the pits. <gasps> He's alive? Yes, he's alive. Uh, someone let Rude know that he's that we're good. He can come back. If you hit him on Facebook, let him know we're good. We're we're we are now seeing Randy. He's uh he's getting around the track. It's amazing. He's on, he's on an actual racing line. He went through that little little carousel corner a little bit. I mean, yeah. Excellent. I Randy is many... still with us. We we have Randy with us right now. Randy, what is your current state after your charity case? Uh, whatever was happening is is now. Oh well, boy. Full swing. So so the good news uh, <laughs> tonight, just from what the community did, we brought together about, about three hundred bucks for charity. Nice. Just because you guys have questionable decision making skills, and I love it. I like but that you're parking in the shade. By to the top way. all of that right. off, I am donating for every incident point I got in every race. Mm -hmm. So you guys have brought in so much goddamn money for charity, and I'm so <laughs> proud of all of you, and I love every one of you. How many incidents have we counted up so far? Oh, uh, the first two races together have 45. <laughs> Woo Congratulations. Congrats. That that's that's a low number. You you got to pump those numbers up. Those are rookie numbers. Well, that's what the third race is for. Excellent. How uh how have you finished? Have you finished? Uh, I've been about mid-pack in both races, which is really really derogatory to about half of each race <laughs> <laughs> well said well said well we'll let you get back to whatever it was that you were don't, doing don't let him go yet how many shots no? have okay. you done so far how many shots have you done so far <laughs> oh oh god um 17 if i had to guess uh, i'm surrounded by bottles of yes of what uh, we started with Johnny Walker Black, and then we ran out and we went to Red, and now we're on some kind of rum, and I think now we're in the Costco bottle. Oh, wow. It's, the, the quality has gone downhill as the night has gone downhill. Excellent oh, job, Randy. I don't mess around for charity. Yeah, good job. should mention that all of this driving off the track has remained off the track and will unfortunately only count as one incident point, as I understand it. Well, I mean, this is this is exactly like driving the Pinto. It's just like a tractor. Well, if you uh, could finish the night off by pounding like like shotgun in an ice house light, that'd be perfect. Ice house light. Oh, I don't oh we'll, that. we'll get there. Yeah, it's perfect. All right. Well, we'll let Randy get back to whatever it was he was what it was doing. So, thank you for joining us, Randy. Thanks, guys. I love you. Randy's about to pound shot number eighteen. You know, it's all good. Uh, clutch it, clutch yeah. detective work to find Randy, by the way. Rude, thank you. He was surprisingly coherent. I was he literally even in pulled my... over to do the interview. That's class. <laughs> that, what a classy I gentleman. Been... <laughs> yeah, I, I, I was. Yeah, I, I, oh, I want to give a, uh, a shout out to, uh, let's see, Lazard in YouTube chat. Thank you so much for pointing out that he was here. Thank you. <laughs> the Roomba uh, cat is amazing. Yes, CM, I agree. And, and someone in chat going by the just amazingly reputable handle Slut Food, yikes, has just said, "Bish, where's my money?" Which is wonderful. I, I love, <laughs> I love that I know who that is, and I love that they played drums in a band I was in many years. No oh way! Oh my god! Excellent. <laughs> yeah. Was the band called Slut Food? 
Sadly, no. Although we oh, were called, we were called for one, uh, one show. We were called Urethra Franklin. So we had that going. <laughs> Bachman Turner underdrive. <laughs> Bachman Turner underwear. I think is the right way to do it. Somebody can come up with something better. Somebody in the chat, give me something better than uh, Bachman Turner Overdrive. Ever since the, ever since I saw Bish, where's my money? I can't get Family Guy out of my head with Stewie <laughs> just beating Brian to a right. <clears throat> Let's see. Uh, Shane Cochran in this race is the uh, Letterkenny car. Also worth pointing out. The Jeep Marrow. Is the it? Jeep is he, he's still yes. in the Jeep Marrow. Yeah. There you go. Look at that grill. Look at that grill. The it Jeep, looks like a cow catcher. The Jeep Marrow. It does. It's yeah. beautiful. It looks like a. Uh, it looks like Bro a, dude. A, a prop. A prop out of uh, Back to the Future 3 is what that looks like. <laughs> yes. It's, it's the front of the train. Yes. Pitter patter on the. Oh, this is this is just keeps getting better. That's total letter, Kenny. Oh, man, that's great. Oh, the bro, dude. Bro Bucking and turn chain drive. We're getting <laughs> <laughs> nice T oversteer. Yes. Oh, Randy. Randy is uh in the in was uh Headed down the straightaway there. Let's check on our boy Randy. He's doing dandy. Is he holding it straight? He's doing no, it. He's, he's actually slowing down for the turn as we're getting ready to uh, get the grid set up for our race here. Looks, looks like we've like got a 25 small cars. Grid. Yeah. yeah, 25. I do love Oreo Speedwagon, Sean. Oreo Speedwagon. Oreo Speedwagon. Yeah, yes, I Oreo, Spe Oreo Speedwagon. That's great. That is a Lemons car. Have you guys seen the Oreo Speedwagon? No, 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 no it, I have not. It is I, a... It is a Honda Del Sol that is made up like a radio flyer, and then they put a seven-foot Oreo into the back of it, like hanging over the roof. So it's the Oreo Speedwagon. Okay, guys, uh, we do have we do have the Mirth Mobile in this race. I just realized yes. that. So that's excellent, Harold Darner, repping the Mirth Mobile on, party time. Pole. Excellent. Looks like Mirth uh, on pole. Check that oh, out. Oh, uh, I, I failed to mention the license plate last week, guys. If you yeah, noticed swing. that this week, yeah, swing, swing, fantastic, very good. All right, starting on the pole again, the Mirthmobile. What if we started? The chat is literally nothing but band names. Bachman, Turner, and Hooch. That's excellent. Are you Hackman? Turn it over. It will drive. Or, or are you Speed Dealer? I believe is an actual band. <laughs> Why wouldn't it be? Indeed. Let's see mm. who else is in this race? Anton Lovett and uh, Amanda Tolley, who won three races on the trot last year. Matt Farides in the uh, the tiger striped uh, Camaro. Dustin Are we Levitt down to one Anton? We're only down. We only have one Anton. Oh no! I think so uh, Dustin Levitt is in the Brondo car, I believe. Mm. Yes, yep, yep, there it is. He has what plants crave. Yeah. <laughs> It's President Camacho on the on the hood, <laughs> and uh, and the sponsor who we can in the back. Oh, whoops! Is the slurm car is the slurm car in this one? Because if it whoops. is, I want to see the slurm car and the Brondo car go at it. The whoops! Uh, somebody didn't get the memo on the single file. It's almost like some guy who's sitting here talking to you didn't tell anybody about that at the beginning of the race. <laughs> well, who would that who would that be? I don't know, Eric. What's, What's what's the worst that could happen? Yeah, does, does it really matter? Uh, Angus Pert in this race also races a Mini Cooper in real life and is a Mini Cooper that is street registered, street parked, and driven to and from the races, which is a bold strategy. What is the the Jetta Fist? What is that? That's <laughs> so. This is this this requires a. This is real. Okay, <laughs> okay. This is real. So we've had almost everything we've ever to see in life, including a racing bed like a like a four poster bed with the dust ruffles going in the breeze the one thing we haven't had is a car that is totally made up to just be a giant fist and that's exactly what we want to see i'm <laughs> guessing that's some lemon insider who has done and, and i appreciate it's angus angus, angus thank you so much so you want it to be like uh like a like a float like a parade float like styrofoam <laughs> okay yep totally we gotta, we gotta get the look we gotta get the look last. we gotta get the well, look down the hood at the fist i think it's required <laughs> there we go you just better hope he doesn't 
back into anybody. Oh. Uh, he's he's laying back. Uh, he's doing he's doing a responsible thing here, being this part of this class. All right. So, the field works their way okay. around. Yeah, I'm at, I'm at a loss of words. The the fit the fist I think was just just too much. <laughs> Too much it's to process. It's a lot. It, it's great, though. I mean, you know, shout out for sure. Green flag <laughs> about to come out. <laughs> the back end puncher. Yeah, that's what that looked. Yep. <laughs> shout out for sure. Fist, yeah. fist right in the Angus. Yeah, that that's true. On the Angus. Oh, green flag's out. Mirth Mobile headed down into Party turn on. one. Party on. Slut food pointing out that our national Anton <laughs> reserves are running short. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, we got a blinker in third place right now. There's a car there. There's a car not there. There's a car. It's the uh, Romulan cloaking device on the third place Miata <laughs> is Brandon. blinking in and out. Brandon Mullins. Is showing. Yep, that's Brandon mm. Mullins who races for Ritz, uh, which is best known as Garbage Raced in the South. They're a team out of South Carolina, I believe. <laughs> uh, good look at Trogdor right there. I say Romulan cloaking device in my nerd is showing. You say Trogdor all as well. That's really? Right. That's right. <laughs> that makes so sense. <laughs> Quiet. As Burning eight all it, Romulans. How's that? As I, as I now mentioned, they're headed into the root cat. Uh, oh, yeah. Carousel. Oh, yeah. Yeah. No, no nerd showing there at all. <laughs> nope. nope. Oh, oh, where, 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 wow. Where did he come from? <laughs> Where did he come from? Wow, I don't, I don't even know what to say. Something, something cloaking device, right? Yeah. Did I get that <laughs> right? Something, something. That reference, okay. <laughs> That's great. <laughs> he came uh, out of light speed and just joined the track right there, like. <laughs> See, I that's what replay, oh, but the Mirth Mobile goes wide. New leader, Bland. Now he's he's going into the pits. Why is he going into the pits? He just got to the race. Hmm. That was interesting. Been a long night. Good night. This this is this is what we need. This is this is what America should be doing on a Thursday night. <laughs> we should all be Randy Bishing at this point. So we're basically we're taking the place of Thursday night football. You know, I'm still and confused. Why not? about Thursday night football since I went like 10 years without television uh, and then suddenly people are like yeah it's Thursday night football how do you not know this this, this, is, how, this is how in touch I am with, with pop culture I'm scared that I do know this because I live in the state the great state of Alabama and I've been here for 17 years and my, neither my wife nor I care about football in any way shape or form and they've let us stay they've let us stay you just, it's you just say roll tight like once every couple months and no uh, shout out to our one Twitch viewer who is chatting in the chat. It has been an entertaining night. Thank you, Speedster. I like it. Shane Cochran somehow in the uh, the letter Kenny Carr DFL at the moment. I say roll tire. And I get tire. weird looks when I say it. Okay. There's one person there's one person in Twitch and they're chatting. It's the Kanye West I like fish dicks. <laughs> Number two for Will Fisher. Phil like uh, Kanye does like fish dicks. That's right, fish dicks. That's right, fish dicks. Love. The almost food. The almost. The almost food. Can I ask who the one person in Twitch is chatting with? Us. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay. he says. I he want, says, I yeah, one person in Twitch. It's the underscore speedster. We 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 love you. Thank you. Carry that torch. Is that right. Chris Probably. Hansel? Wave if you're Chris Hansel. Chris Hansel? <laughs> Chris Hansel has a... Uh, so he had a Project Speedster. Oh, the show. oh. Was it? it took oh, him forever to... See, see, see Snizzle and... Oh, oh. Oh. We, we have more than one Twitch viewer. Apparently we my like uh, information... Now? Yeah, well, I don't know. I'm seeing... Oh, hey, hey everyone, if you're watching out on Twitch, please please comment in the chat. That is apparently... Look at this. There's three. There's three unique chat. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Wow. Number Twitch three. just exploded. Oh, Screeching Twitch Music Official. That's four. That's four. Ye oh, look at this. There's five. It's amazing. Thank you. Yeet to you guys as well. We love you. How many are in YouTube right now? Because I, I, all I can see is the chat. I can't see the numbers. 172. Congratulations to all of you. 
we don't know why you're here, but we appreciate the fact that you are. We Randy, don't know why we're Randy here. Bish leaving the pits, ladies and gentlemen. The 742 Solstice is in the pits with uh, President Camacho proudly on the hood. I know who you are, Chris Hansen, but I likes to call you Chris Hansen. <laughs> Excellent. Excellent. <laughs> Uh, Tom Lomito in this race, also worth pointing out. He is a killer of many Volkswagen Fox engines, uh, Man, and now Volkswagen the Twitch, Golf the, engines. And the Twitch TV. has exploded. There is nothing but Twitch icons in the chat right now. This is amazing. They were lurking. They were lurking. They were waiting for you to notice them. Senpai noticed. Yes. It's, a, it's another 12-person <laughs> raid Corn dog, Twitch. Corn Dog Butthole says, race cars, race cars, yeah. That's right. Dale, yeah. yeah. Dale, yeah, see Snizzle. I would like to watch Will Fisher for a little bit, but he's blinking in and out so bad that I just can't handle it. And now uh, I actually go to uh, Philip Couturier. He's trying to pass the bish right now. He's yeah, we're, yeah well, we were, you know what? We're already on that battle. Wonderful. That's, That's twice tonight. Thank you, Douglas, for coming to be part of the joke. We appreciate that. Driver oh, Prius at, says, yo, found the Twitch. Welcome, Driver Prius. Look at Randy Bish just doing the, the neighborly thing and getting out of the way. Uh, Yoder, Yoder Donnie X6 needs yeah. your help. He says, I'm here by accident. How do I leave? Please help. <laughs> you can't leave. You're, you're here now. You're stuck. You're All right. I actually have to go us. to Twitch one now. Of yes. Us. Yes. One of us. Anybody have who to investigate has X6, this. if they're talking about a BMW, they are they have somehow definitely arrived in the wrong place if they're lemons following. Wait, wait, wait. I but we're gonna race a BMW. It's not ne well you're racing an E twenty one. Oh, oh, well, oh it's still a BMW. I don't know what just happened there, but it was great. Wow. That was a Jetta trying to die and not dying. That might be Jeff Wakeman in the in the Jetta who is uh, Oh he's off again. He's yeah. way off. Way off. He like might as well not even try to get back. If he's no God, he should have just gone straight across. To the eight of you watching on Twitch, so. we love you. We're up to eight on Twitch. That, that's a record. That Write is. It down. Write it that's down. A, that's no, a raid, no, Douglas. Man. Douglas, it doesn't count as cheating. We appreciate the love. He wanted to know if it was cheating if if he's watching on YouTube and on another device. No, no, Douglas. The more the merrier. Thank you so much. Can we see how Indeed. last place is doing? Yes, we can. In, in the 27th channel. place, we have Mr. Jeffrey Wakeman. Yep, who was just off the track. Yeah, we were just showing him, and he had that uh, interesting uh, interaction with the race leader. Way. This is one of several times this team has come up in conversation with me today. Um, there we go. Here's the last place car. Jeffrey Wakeman with a big tank slapper. Jeff Wakeman, part of uh, the Everyone Racer. Yes. Lemons Team 3 Pedal Mafia, who That's raced a Citroen SM with an S&M theme. Oh! Uh, oh! Yeah. <laughs> I was going to say, let's let's spend a lap with last place, courtesy of the chat. Thank you. Jeffrey Wakeman uh, misses his beach time. Tried to get a little bit here at some point. Who the I.O.? I hope you're happy. This is just for you. Last that place coverage. Not dominating. Not dominating. Being dominated, as one does, when you race an SM. That is the racing line. You're absolutely right. You know what corner we're getting close to? Race bar. Oh, yeah. Go for it. Oh. Race bar on YouTube says race bar. Good job. Good job. <laughs> I assume you're reading your driver's license. <laughs> Into the cat in a shark costume on a Roomba carousel. Last place oh shout out. God. Jeffrey Wakeman getting the job done out there. Ish. That was kind of a line. Yeah, no, it was, it was impressive. It was, it was a line. Yes. Will Fisher and Kanye we need kind of a run away cat in a shark costume emote. I agree, Douglas. We'll have to work on that for you. Yeah, we're only reading Twitch. Everyone else is not important, Speedster. So <laughs> keep it keep it coming. It's just 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 Twitch now. Who else do we have in this race? Guy Argo, like I mentioned in the previous race, former Lemons winner. Ooh, let's have Mori from Tarp, uh, organizer, guy who helped us launch this thing. Anton Lovett, three-time uh, Lemons Drivers Champion. Who is, who is the organizer that helped us launch this? 
Uh, Pat Mulry. Oh yeah, Mr. Mulry. Let's let's pick him up. Uh, actually, he's Car not on the track, seven. unfortunately, right now. Uh, that sounds. Better. What is yeah. what is the livery going on on Matthew Richardson's car? Twenty uh, first place, number three hundred two, Miata. All I can uh, read is eat trash. Live fast, eat trash. Uh, trash panda. Trash panda. Tra yeah. Trash pandas. Trash panda. okay. Yes. Okay. HPD E four is pretty much WTW. Uh, should point out that uh, Matt Richardson races with delinquent racers, West Coast team who race a Mercur, which is which is <laughs> so many levels below any Miata. Um, yeah, but, but it's yeah, wonderful. It's 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 perfect for lemons. I, I can't remember if they're the guys with the vaguely. <laughs> what is on the theme. back of this car? There's a trash panda, obviously. I mean, the two gentlemen. Uh, yeah. I don't. I'm guessing that's teammates. That would be. I vaguely recognize the guy on the left. Can't quite place him, but whoever's <laughs> happening there is great. Acer Speed wants to know: Should Twitch Chat be abbreviated to Twat? No, that would work. Derek Lutz asking if this is the second race. About halfway I, through it. I think he wanted to call that Twat, maybe. But you know, I like where your brain is. It's nice. Right. Right. Will Fisher DKP. continuing to lead the way in the DKP production saying they're going to super glue toenail clippings onto a car. That would, you be, know, you that do would what, be amazing. You do whatever is going to make you happy. And Izzy plus 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 in, in the YouTube chat wants to know if he can bring a car to a race with square wheels. You Why not? <laughs> Why not? Yeah. As long as they're 190 treadwear, yes. There you go. Problem solved. Triangle wheels. Bring it with triangle wheels. <laughs> should mention again this race is brought to you by the West Virginia Kangaroo Razor. Have you thought of owning a kangaroo? Kangaroo the only state of, or kangaroo the only state. West Virginia the only state where you don't need a permit to do so. They make great, great pets and will only maul you once they're fully grown. You got a couple of years till that happens. Uh, so so get yourself a kangaroo. Municipal and county ordinances may apply. Cease, and if you don't want one, move to the great state of Kangaroo and get yourself right. a West Virginia. That's right. That's right. Uh, C Nizzle, C Nizzle 23 says, y'all should make it so the guys with faster cars have to use WASD on their keyboards or DDR pads and joysticks, Wiimotes, etc. And the slower cars can use the racing wheels. I like that idea. I like that idea, too. I mean, That's what great. could ever go wrong? No. Yeah. And we you're right. You're wrong. right. Original user. This is awesome. Thanks for tuning in and joining us. Uh, Maybe D we need to uh, go ahead. I'm sorry. I was gonna say DKP. Kangaroo, it's what's for dinner. I was gonna say DKP production says kangaroo. It's what's for dinner. I know ostrich is good. I don't know about kangaroo, but ostrich is delicious. Hmm. I've had I've had alligator. Good. Okay. Can be good. You gotta cook it right, but it can be yeah, good. right. Eat pride. I'm I'm just watching the wreck at Ralph car. The number thirty four. I'm literally getting uh, a text. I'm getting an angry text message telling me that we don't care about the lead car. So let's work our way back. <laughs> Thank you, Dr. Mary Harris, who probably had a really long day at the ER today. Thanks for watching, Mary. Let's see who else is around. Let's let's go watch Anton if he's if he's in it. We were and on the Devlin. leader for a while there, but uh, yeah, yeah, boring, right? You know, Anton is in the sim but not moving. Uh, you really need to go to Anton real quick. Just just put him on camera. Just real quick. Just because. There you go. You go. <laughs> uh, Anton. Looks like a, a tree. You, you wanted to see what's going on at the back of the pack. There yeah, it is. Leave it here for a second. Anton has only, in the time that anybody's known him in Levin, Lemons, worn a bright yellow racing suit, exactly like the one his driver is wearing. And that's fantastic. And then people in Lemons found whatever manufacturer was making them. So all kinds of people have the le yellow racing suit, just like Anton has in that, with the bare white helmet. So that is the Lemons look, believe it or not. And Anton coined that. It's great to see it in virtual space. Welcome As back to the party, Anton. Welcome back to the party. You got the backup car out. Let's see if you can pull out into traffic here and provide some entertainment. Anton is a hell of a wheel man in real life. Should mention. I know he's he's new to the world of virtual racing. All right, chat wants to see all twenty seven cars, so we'll start at the top and we'll show you all twenty seven cars. Whoa, that's a little bit of a personal close up there with the Kanye. And there's Kanye. 
And there's under the hood of the Camaro. Okay, so we have the uh, car that you're familiar with. <clears throat> Here's the 98 machine. Postal fail. Ooh. Totally postal oh. fail. Oh. oh, heck yeah. That was the right time to go there. <laughs> Doing the Earnhardt Senior. Passing the grass. Good job. Excellent. Oh, all right, so going through the field. Oh, David Carpenter in that cheaty machine. Yes, yep. love it. Love to He's see it. He's been in all three weeks so far. See Dave. He races a Cressida in real life. Excellent. Uh, a Kevin, Cressida. Kevin yep. Mo M O E B S is that Moebs? Uh, Meebs? Sure. Meebs. I'd go with Moebs. Uh, he's Ooh, the he's in the uh, 007 GoldenEye machine. Excellent. Mm, Excellent. Oh, Nintendo 64 job. edition. It's that's N64. Yeah. Yes, it's an N that's beautiful. Way to go, Who Kevin. Who throws a shoe, honestly? <laughs> uh, Sean Bundy in the Wreck It Ralph machine that we've talked that we had on camera. I'm gonna wreck it. Yep, yeah, that's right. That's a good looking car. Ooh, double suck Miata for James Pancos. <laughs> <laughs> that car is worth it. That's worth explaining. So that Please is do. wonderful. James was part of a team that took a Toyota Corolla uh, FX16, I think. Maybe it's GTS. And Grand Toyota Turismo MR2, view, by the way. Cut them in half and put them together and had a double engine car. Hence what? the doubles. Yeah. Ah. Wow. That car was in magazines, was it not? I, it was, I seem yes. to remember that. Yeah, I remember that car being all yeah. over the place. Yeah, the, uh, Pat Mulry also drove that car. Who's next? All right, the 14 of Thomas Lamino. There you go, Tom Lamino, team far from winning. As soon as possible, pizza Hello, correcting please? my Bill Ar Dale Earnhardt, telling me that it was Bill Elliott. I'm sorry. I apologize. Driver's Ed car looking good. Daniel Half. Ooh, the, the the fist mobile with the Mini Cooper on the side. Angus Pert. Yes, he's, yeah, that is his actual Lemons car. Excellent. Touch. Oh, Simon. <clears throat> Ricky Rudd hurt. Ricky Rudd, yeah. I thought that was a tennis ball in the uh, rear quarter there. The land. I believe leading class C. Correct. Mm -hmm. Yep. Behind he's him part, we have the, 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 Murph, the Murph Mobile. Party time. Excellent. Party on Wayne. Jesse Thomas making a pit stop. Andrew Shembury in the Sorrento... What on earth? Is that a pizza a on top of the car? Oh, pizza. nachos. Yeah, nachos. Yeah. yeah Authentic yeah. Mexican cheese, and then we have nachos on the roof. <laughs> <laughs> Guacamole. Nachos. Yes, upside down. Na oh, that's beautiful. You should mention Andrew voluntarily races a Plymouth Duster for some reason. Not a good 70s oh, one. Oh, oh, oh the nachos. Are those two? Okay, wait, 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 wait. We just had, we had something happen there. We got to find yeah, it. he nicked a... No, we had a, a, a hold on. I gotta find it. Here we. Oh well, we don't want to show, we don't want to show that too much. <laughs> anyway, or whatever. All right. Yeah, here's a look. Oh, the Guy Fieri Flavor Town USA machine for Nick Sharp. That's beautiful, Nick. Love it. Oh yeah, master of flavor. <laughs> Vote. <for> <laughs> 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 nice. That's guy would be proud. Oh, oh no, he, he's oh, missing good. some nice cross, nice uh, strut tower there. But he's missing something important. As you get a good look yeah, at his coil packs, those are important. He's braced up and he's fine. Yep. He's good. Yep, he is good. Flavor Town on the windshield, excellent. All right, Shane Cochran, the bro dude, letter Kenny Carr, most excellent. Yeah, Jeep Marrow. Look at Jeep those, look at those front wind. brake rotors; they're glowing. Look Should that. mention that Shane races for Collateral Damage Racing. Raced a Chevy Cavalier with a Chris Hansen theme. It was a to catch a predator. It's very high minded. It was Chris Hansen catching the predator from the predator movies <laughs> of the 1980s. <laughs> oh, Danny Glover would be proud. Randy Bish still getting it done out there. Well, I mean, I drink it. Yeah, he's there. There he is. He doesn't know he's there, but there he is. Trash Panda theme. Melanie Dale Walker. Jr. Foundation. Yeah, Melanie Walker. I want I want to know why DKP Productions is telling people to bring a bag full of spaghettios and they'll be fine. A That's, bag full of spaghettios. We'll get there. We'll get, <laughs> you I'll go, Eric. This, one, this one's for you, Eric. 
compared to Folgers. I love it. Great value. <laughs> I, can't, I love when stupid things I say become a thing. That's my favorite. That's yes. literally a great value car. That's wonderful. Thank you, Frank Kevin. Well, my first sponsor of the race. Great oh. value coffee compared to Folgers. I love the I was, trunk. The I trunk was logo. Actually, there. I was there. <laughs> That's amazing. Excellent, that excellent, amazing. excellent, Frank. Yeah. Yeah, he was about to go off there, which is great. Oh, Robert McDaniel's Duff beer. Let's see if I can find it. Oh, yep. All right. Yep. The Duff beer in the pits. They nice. usually race a Triumph Stag. It's their most recent car. I think we'll stay on the front of this one. <laughs> We've got this guy. Not sure. Should point out these guys found a um, an old drinking fountain and somehow rigged it up to shoot out Gatorade. Yes. And then they would uh, just put some indistinct clear booze in a cup and then pour the Gatorade into it from the drinking fountain. That sounds amazing. Ooh, Which there's a. We have a keyboarder. Check out the steering on this one. Yes. Oh, getting it, Brandon, getting it, getting it done. Let's go on board. <laughs> yes. Lord. Yes. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yes. <laughs> through, through the all-important cat on a carousel. Brandon, point. he's actually holding a pretty good line. He though. is doing a fantastic <laughs> job, and that's very difficult. Oh, he'll come back. Everyone watch the cat. How many laps in? Everyone watch the cat. Down. Everyone watch right. the cat and keep your fingers crossed. He's going to come back. Come on. How many laps into this are we? We're... Let's, give, let's give some Fs for Brandon's keyboard. Brandon Mullins on the keyboard. The cat is sad. Fs Brandon in the chat. Mullins has run like 12 laps. The front tires are corded, but he's run 12 <laughs> laps. <laughs> oh, man. We have a battle at the front here, guys, between Philip and Will. All battling out. See these two duking it out, I, like I should it. say. Yes. Oh, we have a gaggle. Wait, wait, wait. Is this actual oh, racing? Oh, contact. Again? Yes, we have actual racing. Oh, contact again. Trying to deal with traffic. Oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh. Will ending up on the wrong side of that. What was that? that I believe the Great Value Coffee. That was your Folgers car. Yeah, yeah. That, was, that was your Folgers, Folgers car. Compared to Folgers. Me. Compared to Folgers. <laughs> right. Thank you. And that concludes the actual racing portion of this race. <laughs> Hey, please tell me he's actually playing on a on a Guitar Hero controller Who says and not a keyboard. Are you serious, Abe? What? He's on a guitar, but somebody Abe Chung it. said he's on a guitar. If he's playing that on a Guitar Hero <laughs> keyboard or on a Guitar Hero controller, he's now my favorite human. <laughs> Is downstrum for throttle, upstrum for brake? <laughs> Please. Yeah. Help no, it would be like downstrum for for right turn, upstrum for left turn, and then the buttons for gas and brake. That's brilliant. That's dedication. Oh, please let that be true, and please let him be shooting video somewhere. Oh man. Oh. Hey, this that is real. Oh, Randy Bish, right in front of the leader, guys. Abe has confirmed that that is literally something he is driving with a Guitar Hero controller. We need to interview this person immediately. We do. Are they in the in the the Discord? Who was it? I don't even. I can't even remember the name. I'm just like I'm. I'm floored by this. Help us out in chat here, uh, Chung. Help us out. Would the drum kit be better or worse, Bob? I think better. Wait, I Wayne. Uh, Gar you. Garth Garth Algar would 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 say the drum kit would be better. Yeah, I totally. Totally dare you to drive with the drum kit, Bob. Oh, we see the Duff the beer car thing. getting it wrong on the straightaway. You hate to see it. The double suck car getting passed by the leader. Abe, do you know if they're streaming this? Like, like is there actual video of this happening? Dude, look that, at the. Did you see the weight transfer on that on the ninety eight machine like, coming into turn one? That was amazing. It, this is apparently part of the garbage race in the South team, so I'll have to check that out uh, post race. But yes, I I most appreciate that that there may be a Guitar Hero controller <laughs> involved in this. I think that may have eclipsed the stop sign. I, I just so more difficult keyboard or Guitar Hero controller. It's got to be gotta, you got to go with Guitar Hero. On guitar that. Hero. That's yeah. These are these are the questions that you end up asking that you had never had occurred to you ever in your life. <laughs> what other race series is going to go digital and then get you to ask these questions? Like, 
What is the most difficult way we can control a car inside a, a video game or a we simulation? To, we, the chat is concerned about Judge Phil. Did he pass out? Oh, crap. He, I think Judge Phil had to go to the bathroom last time I checked, and that was going to happen again. Corndog Butthole says use a trackball. I agree. That would be good. Uh, interpretive sure. dance. Or, oh, the checkered flag's hey, out. Hey, there's Phil. The checkered flag's out. No, I've just, just been muted if you want to talk. I'm talking away. Phil, you're the, you're the guy that got like locked on the roof in uh, was it locked on the roof in Vegas? Skiggy, that guy. Skiggy Gore says I have an idea for a livery, communist Elmo. Do it. Yeah. <laughs> Phil, I mean, what do you think of a guy using a Guitar Hero controller to drive in lemons? That's that's got to be top shelf, right? Yeah, I'm all for that. I mean, I I actually like the idea of just. Uh, like the way you'd hotwire a car where you basically just have a whole bunch of wires that you touch together <laughs> you know for all the controls so you have a bundle of wires you know you're probably a voltage signal of some core, some sort and then a, a whole bunch of uh, like this is left turn wire and you just touch it to the touch it to the power wire i think that'd be even better but the guitar hero controller yeah that's i think it may even beat the dance dance revolution See if we need to see anyone jump doing the jump or having any fun as we see david getting it wrong and going down to the end of the straightaway we're so preoccupied by the Guitar Hero deal that we, we've forgotten to tell everybody. Uh, yeah. Philip Couturier won that. Yep. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh yeah. did we even talk about who won? Oh, 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 Demolition oh, Derby. Man. Oh, here we go. Pre-pedal Mafia car. How do you see that yeah. in front of you and not take place in that? I just don't understand. Yeah, go, go back and watch Jeff Wade. Really spectacular crash, like over on the roof and then into the wall upside down. There Jeff I Wakeman? I static cam looking down. Yeah, Jeff Wakeman. Go, go watch what he just did. It was pretty amazing. Fugue well, just Fugue just yeah. I was waiting to see if we had some. Oh. Uh... I now I I'm gonna have to look for Donkey go. Kong bongos. That's that's brilliant, Fugue. Yeah, you like right. this crash. It's, it's Here we go. Crash. All right. We need Donkey Kong bongos, and we also got to reckon the Golden T uh, yes. trackball. Yes. <laughs> golden T's too new. Let's use centipede. <laughs> no, the the, yeah. the big the big. <laughs> Any giant ball from an arcade game. We need is really Twitch ideal. comments to be the controllers. <laughs> or uh, Tempest. Remember Tempest with the like the round. Oh, here we go. Right, here, here we, we go. go. Oh, oh, yeah. It gets better though. It gets another one. Oh, he just missed him. Oh, uh, well, that's whoa. dead three times whoa. right there. Whoa. Okay, hold on. In real life. Well done, Jeff Wakeman. Triple yeah. dead. I want to see that from the Jeff cockpit. Is, Jeff is one of my, my favorite lemons racers, actually, so I just look forward to seeing him when I'm at one of the East Coast races. Mm-hmm. Your three Pedal Mafia people are great. I, I wrote yeah. Jay in to hear. Uh, Jay, thoughts on this evening? Uh, I've never been so proud in my life. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's uh, uh, on board that's with, a great way to... On board with Jeffrey again. We got to we get the gyro cam involved in that. He uh, It was just too impressive to not see that again. Uh, Jay, can we get a play-by-play -play of what you're thinking as a race car? Jeff's going to be racing a car in a couple months. Well, this isn't actually that different from what Jeff usually does, so I'm somewhat nonplussed. Well, this it. part, though, like he aims for the Camaro, then he uses oh, yeah, no, the I, I, I was I was talking about this part. <laughs> yeah, okay. Yep, triple dead. And he gone. Yeah, no, that's, that's pretty much standard. I liked aiming for the wedge-shaped car to get some air. I mean, that was a Worth pointing out, Dave Carpenter is his actual real life team. So, so there, there's some some amount of uh, camaraderie in in sending your teammate into orbit. Well, I think you I think you pick the Camaro that's in front of you. Actually, it's probably just random, unless he set it up for him. Well, Jay, I, I know you probably have slightly better things to do, like walk the dog or you know anything <laughs> else. You got any final thoughts for? Him? Uh, no, I, I think this was spectacular. This is really the greatest thing that's ever happened. And uh, I just, you know, can't wait to keep doing it and doing it. And the fact that all these people are now not dead, except for future cirrhosis in the liver, makes me very proud and happy. Indeed. All right. Thanks for joining us tonight, Jay. Thanks. Thanks, Jay. Bye, guys. Hey, Lamb, everybody. Bye, Jay. Bye. So, uh, I think the demo derby's wrapping up on the front straight. Am I Yep. All right, I'm literally trying to find this grits uh, Facebook page, but oh, they're on board. There are many, go. many grits. Facebook this is going to be good. Oh, oh, oh Randy wow, Bish, 50 miles space. 
Wow, where did if Randy... ever there deserve to be Fs in chat. Randy Bish. Took Ouch. the Fs out, man. Bish, at least <laughs> Bish didn't feel that. Bastard. He didn't feel it, which is good. <laughs> the license plate is most excellent. Can catch that. But this is going to be a good replay. Actually, yeah. Bish is so drunk right there now that he probably would have survived oh. that. <laughs> well, I don't know. That's, that's a lot of Gs, right? Oh, there. yeah, but he just I mean, would never know. He's like I, 22 shots in by now. I think his cough syrup bottle fell out of the triangle <laughs> cup holder right there. Oh, he got hit so hard he went through the, the concrete barrier and didn't hurt the barrier. It, 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 it like warped through the wall. I think we need to get back to the discussion about pushing that. I think weird homemade controllers, different controllers, vacuum cleaner controllers, TV remotes. Boy, that's really what this should all be about. We're getting there. I mean, yeah. we've already gotten 10 times more than we had the first couple. So it, it's yeah. getting better and better. <laughs> and by that, I mean worse and worse. And just what it should be. There's this all is... this pouring out of <laughs> dead cars. What are they doing? No. I mean, as cool as this is, oh. take, take what you see right there and then imagine fenders, doors, glass, exhaust parts, valve covers, wheels. Oh, wow. That was oh, my God. That's miles such miles a hard hit. Um, but Wreckfest would take that like 10,000 times up. You know, it reminds me when I was a kid, I had those SSP racers, the, the classy smashers. Remember those? Like the... Uh, he had like a Bentley where when it crashed into something, all the uh, the yeah. doors and fenders would fly off. Yeah, yeah. that was so great. I they think flip, like and like they flip over to dented panels, and you had to flip them back to the straight panels, kind of thing. No, they were, they were permanently dented panels that would oh, lock wow. This is early, early '70s. Wow, here's the screenshot that I need. I yep. don't think we have got you covered. Flying off these cars, though. Got you I, covered we were... there. Got you covered. That wow. is. That I mean body parts too. That is an amazing impact. <laughs> I, was that a triple or a quadruple sow cow? I like how I can see quadruple where the spare tire to, goes. Yeah, uh, YouTube chat, which says it was uh, the first quadruple in the world. So lemons is set record. I'm gonna go ahead and call. I'm gonna call that the Iron Lotus. <laughs> That's for the Jetta. <laughs> Stop. Sorry. Oh, we're, we're, only, we're focused the on the Jetta, but that Camaro, my God. <laughs> it looks like when you when when you get sweet leaf there. I like I like it, it reminds me of when you see like the drag car that hits the other drag car at two hundred miles an hour. That's exactly what just happened there. But no consequences. So that part's great. So it appears that a lot of cars have windshield uh yeah yeah and that's part of the high racing so if they can do that why can't they have you know starter motors flying off on the track ask you they could it'll right. be in the next update that breaks yeah everything. <laughs> the, the 400 <laughs> meg update yeah. i heard that eric oh. that was good <laughs> he didn't really say that the radiator lives to, to fight another day that's quite a radiator is that an intercooler like a really big i think it's radiator yeah, it's a radiator. Right. I Treat do stock. love the golden eye livery, though. I like how Randy's stuck on the. Uh... <laughs> he's got, but he's got the throttle <laughs> match. <laughs> it's digging. It's digging. Right it is. Hey, he's. It looks like he's moving. Oh, it stopped. He was well, moving he, forward. He was deep into the Kirkland brand Uzo last we talked to him. We should actually try to get him back on the broadcast. So the high dollar is a idea. Yeah, I mean, well, Kirkland Uzo is better than four dollar a bottle of Uzo. It only costs six dollars, so it's worth it. All right, well, there's his... Oh. Whoa! Wow. What on earth? I think... Yeah, I think Whoa. these spectators are now involved. All right, y'all. You need to take all of these controller ideas. You need to go to the uh, the Lemons Whoa. Are Racing page and just start, like, posting them there. We need, we need a controller, like centric post on the on the racing page and then we need people to actually do it because some of this stuff is, is would be epic well i've i've built an arcade emulator melanie walker get in on it so i could just add the uh... oh that's some good bloodlust right there that's seeing it coming from three quarters of a mile away and leaning into it. 
Wow. The solstice just or- goes into orbit. It's like it's like watching oh, boxing, yeah. knowing one person's about to destroy the other. Wow, Melanie. More for that? Incredible. What for? So, <laughs> Look at the shadow shattered. in the smoke while she's upside down. It's amazing. The smoke shadow. Is, is it full 360 and then lands on the wheels? Because it looks like it's going to land on the wheels. Uh, I think it's going to land on the on the recorder. Oh, yeah. no. Oh, 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 no. Yeah. oh, oh. oh, oh, oh. Rip. Yeah, that's ouch. Yeah, that's that's four right. deaths right that was there. A, right? That was a late twist. I didn't <laughs> see the twist coming at first. So, ouch. if we're going to informally issue an IOE for this, I mean, do we give it to the Dance Dance Revolution previous race? Or do we give it to Guitar Hero? You know, this brings up the God, I got... of, it's a little bit of inside baseball here, Phil, because there's always yeah. that that discussion about IOE versus org choice and. Uh, you know. Yeah, people actually, it's not very secret because whenever we're having that discussion, penalty box, you know, seeing how we make the sausage, and it actually turns out to be really sort of, sort of illusion shattering when you find out that we're we're all too human. Gonna hurt. <laughs> you know, when it comes to that sort of thing, like, shit, do we have enough video of that car? You know, Ooh. no, no, this is really gonna really hurt. This is really gonna <laughs> hurt. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh. oh. But I, I'd say, like, yeah, the I think we really need to plumb the depth depth of the controller, uh, sort of custom controller thing. And I, I really do like bare wires. I mean, maybe even nails, like sixteen penny nails hooked up to wire, <laughs> touching to each other. Like nail them into a two by four, and then you've got a you've got a controller nail that you touch to, like the nails nailed into the two by four. Like here's left turn, here's right turn. There'd be a lot of the sort of erratic control inputs. I think we're going to see it actually fist work. get rammed into something. Oh, yeah, we are. It's time to get fisted. So you want the, the bad electrician videos from YouTube, but you want controllers with that guy? Well, when we talk about the fist <laughs> yes. mobile, I think, I think we need to emphasize the fact that we're talking about a giant fist that looks like a fist in three dimensions. But this is, this is the, closest this we the best thing we, yeah. we've ever had. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> he finally got here. Holy yeah. God. Thank God. Yeah. We're so worried about him. Wow. Could you find someone that voted for Dean, actually? Is it possible to do? I think there were four, maybe five people that voted for him. Someone must have. I mean, he was in it for a while. Wow. Well, Angus. Angus, get I your money's worth. Angus got it. Angus got his money's worth. Too. Whoa. <laughs> What was that? That was the Lord Humongous. Oh, okay. <laughs> I said, what a beauty plan. Shut Just walk away. away. Phil, you and Jason Torchinski need to come up with a control. But he mentioned Torchinski's <laughs> motion controller. He, he, yeah. You are the right evil geniuses for this kind of thing. Yeah, you know, Torchinski actually would be very good for that, too. Well, maybe he and I can have a copy. <laughs> I think I could build something a lot more hoopty, but he'd probably do something a lot more creative. DKP Productions suggesting a flashlight can <laughs> control. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> I don't know what that is. is it, are they controllable? I thought the flashlight was a really tech, you know, onanistic device, if you know what I mean. I don't know what it is. Uh, we can take that. We can take that into <laughs> oh. I think, uh, boy, I, I, I don't think there's a higher note for us to go out on. Yeah, I think you're right. <laughs> Final thoughts, gentlemen? Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, I, I got to go actually do some of this writing. Hey, I'm thanks for joining us. Yeah, yeah, that, was, uh, that was fantastic. Oh, Phil, by the way, oh, yellow. I can't find, so... Yeah, I do have a yellow stick, it's true, but it was cheaper, that's why everyone has it. You know, I don't even say that. No, it's, it's actually a very lemon. Uh, they're, they're, they weren't that much cheaper, though. They were like oh nine God. dollars cheaper, but that makes a difference. That's nine more dollars for us uh, cheese balls. Excellent. That's right. Excellent. Excellent. Well, thanks, Phil. Right. Uh, we'll see you next week. We will. All right. Just show everybody. Well... I don't know what the else there is to say at this point. <laughs> what yes. is that? It was it was in the list. <laughs>
<laughs> it was in the list. It was on okay. the, it was it was requested. Lots of lots uh, of okay. F's in chat. Yes, speedster of the stream was very fun. Pickle Rick controller. Yes, there you go. All of that. Well, uh, boy, it's late. And if you're on the East Coast, it's super late. Uh, I guess we should probably just let everybody move on with their lives, but uh, we'll be back next week uh, with more racing from Barber, which is a place we Ooh. actually race in real life. I love Barber. It's going to be great. Ooh. Metal next Spiders. Week I, might have to, I might have to commentate from the car next week. I love Barber. Yeah, such a great place. Um, we'll talk more about that next week. So at point, I think, was everything we'd hoped for. Of course, as much as we're ever going to get out of West Virginia. I have a request for more Venga <laughs> Boys. So, uh, so I, well, maybe we'll play out with that. Hopefully not <laughs> ruining YouTube for ourselves. Um, oh, no. Oh, gotcha. Yeah, no, we're good. All right. Well, gentlemen, until we do this again next week. Indeed, I'm sufficiently beard. Thanks for tuning in, everybody. We will see you next Thursday. Yo, and please... Please post up a video in the Lemons iRacing page, uh, Facebook page, of uh, you controlling iRacing with the Guitar Hero controller. I can't yes. find you on Facebook or Insta because Grits is everywhere. So I don't know what you're talking about, but share that. We want to see that badly. Thanks for tuning in, y'all. We had a blast. Hope y'all had fun. Settling like the dew, and I have even noticed that the walls are plastered too. The bartender staggered, and he surely had his share. Let's have another drink, we can't go home, it's too darn drunk out there. Kelly was a drinking man, he drank from night till morn. You can always find him at a bar, a soaking up the corn. When closing time would roll around, they'd start to throw him out. He'd get a grip up on the bar, and then he'd loudly shout, Oh, it's drunk out tonight, it's settling like the dew. And I have even noticed that the walls are plastered too. The bartender staggering, he surely had his share. Let's have another drink, we can't go home, it's too darn drunk out there. Kelly's wife came a haunting him with murder in her eye. She found him at his usual spot, soaking up the ride. She got old Kelly by the arm and started for the door. He got a firm grip on the bar and shouted then once more. Oh, it's drunk out tonight, it's settling like the dew. And I have even noticed that the walls are plastered too. The bartender staggered and he surely had his share. Let's have another drink, we can't go home, it's too darn drunk out there. a little cheer he tried to drink up everything and ended up on beer a cop come over